so we studied children who had autism spectrum disorder, uh, children with typical development, and also a group of children with developmental delay who did not have autism. Uh, and we found that their mothers were more likely to have had one of uh, three metabolic conditions that included uh, obesity prior to pregnancy, uh, diabetes during pregnancy, and hypertension. So if you had at least one of those, uh, you were at about a 60% higher chance that uh, you'd have a child with autism or an autism spectrum disorder, and also a child with developmental delay, more than a twofold higher risk uh, if the mom had one of those three conditions. So autism is not going to be due to one factor, so this is not going to be the whole story by any stretch of the imagination. Uh, multiple genes on the one side, multiple environmental factors on the other, possibly happening at different points in time, something around conception, the second trimester, late pregnancy, and even postnatally there may be factors that are contributing. Um, it's going to be a very complicated story, but uh, probably there are individual factors that you can change, and it will, uh, on average in the population, tend to reduce risk.